Hello YouTube subscribers, me Matthew Space. Today I have a cool unboxing for you. So many of you probably know about the Pebble Smartwatch, the Kickstarter project, from probably a little over a year ago now at this point. Almost two uh, I don't know when it was Kickstarter. Go to Kickstarter and just search the Pebble, that's when it you can easy. So today, um I like I wanted to know, so a couple days ago I wanted to know basically was there going to be a Black Friday sale on it? Um someone said, uh no, but if you have a college email address in the United States, where Best Buy is located, you can get $30 off of your, your Pebble. I do not have one, as I'm still a high school student. But this person on app.net, at C-R-O-U-G-H, was kind enough to give me his, and actually he got a second one apparently, somehow, uh, so that guy's lucky, and I got $30 off of the Pebble. So instead of costing me, and I also got Geek Squad, so instead of costing me $160, it only cost me uh, 130 but Best Buy's act thing actually got screwed up, so they kept dropping the price down to, um, they kept dropping the price down on the Pebble to $90 after the $30 discount. The warranty for Geek Squad went down to $15. I saved $60. Through a, I saved $30 through a coupon and $30 through a glitch because their computers are crap. That is awesome. I got this for basically the price that the Pebble was on Kickstarter, like 113. That's awesome. Instead of spending like 180 pretty much or no 173, I spent 113. And that's got a, I love glitches like that. So, let's unbox it. Cuz there's nothing else to do. All right, so let's see. If here's the Pebble, you know, here's the watch box. It's very kind of nondescript. It's like subtle or whatever. I guess you got some watch faces, notifications, the bottom is serial number stuff. The, oh, cool. I don't even need scissors. I can just pull the top off after I cut the plastic. Alright, cutting the plastic. Alright, there, that's the plastic. That can. Oh, and this, and this came off too, that's actually pretty nice. Okay, so now I got to... How do you open this? Um... Maybe I should have checked it off in the box. Um, oh good, they put five to seven day battery life to clear that. Oh, so okay, that's easy, you just... I'm gonna slide it... Tap on it? No. How do you do this? I'm confused. Ah, here we go. Okay, it's stuck. Got it. Oh, there's the watch. That's a nice watch. Here, I got the watch right here. Um, I'm going to take it out of the box. See if there's anything else inside of it. If it can come there. Okay, so there, I got it. Let me just uh, open this tab. Open this other tab. Or not. Okay, so let me just slide this out. There's got to be a way to get this. Unstuck. Oh, well, it's oh, cool. It's all in one box. All right, so this is here. This is the USB port. This is oh, oh, it's cool. It's like a magnetic one. Oh, that's cool. It's a magnet. It's a magnet thing. Uh, here, let me just see if I can demonstrate this on camera. So here, there's two metal prongs here. There's two metal prongs here. It's cool. It's like a magnet type thing, like a MagSafe on a MacBook. That's really cool. Um, so I'll set that aside for now too. I'll have to watch, uh, do that, deal with that later. And now I got to figure out how to get this out of the freaking case. Um, this is the first actual watch that I've owned in years that I actually give a crap about, honestly, because for a teenager or a young adult, honestly, we don't need watches because they do nothing. We've got our phones. However, I bought this because first of all, I got that coupon, and second of all, because it. You know, it just works without... Oh, really? Oh, that's cool. Okay, so it just... Oh, duh. Of course it was that easy. Of course it was that easy. So I got the watch, and now I can just... Uh... Okay, that actually looks pretty good on my wrist. It was right to get the black one. I can always just return and get the red one. Okay, so I've got that, and now I get to... Where's the quick start guide? Ah, here we go. Here's a quick start guide. Okay, so first step is to... I got a text. That's great. Um, okay, how do you turn this on, Pebble? That would really be nice if you could help me turn it on. Um, or, 
Um, okay, I don't know how to turn it on. Uh, let's try this. Here yeah, there it is. Install the Pebble app. Okay, so I gotta take that off. That display looks really nice for an e-ink one. So I just put that here. I'll grab my phone. Okay, so now I'm going to put the watch here for a second. Now I'm going to go get, I have an Android phone at this time, but there's something cool coming in the mail in a couple of weeks. Alright, so here, Pebble, I got the watch. Uh, I know it can do all that. And now I just wait for it to install. But for now, let's just look at the buttons. Alright, so let's see, this is the, according to the guide, this is the back and the power button on the left, and the charging below it, and then this is the up button, this is the select button, and this is the down button. That's pretty simple. It's actually almost stupidly simple. Um, I bet my parents could actually understand this. All right, so let's see. First step is to launch the app. Um, okay, get started because I have the pebble in my hand. Searching for pebbles. This is communicating, I guess. I don't know. I just. Okay, apparently this is my pebble, so I'm going to tap it. Pair. Alright, it's paired. Now it's going to update my pebble, which is cool. I'm ready for update. Do, 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 do. Did I skip this part? No. I don't feel like it. Uh, now I've got another sticky notification. It's just great. Oh cool, it has a little percentage meter on the bottom. Google Plus sucks. Um, it's annoying, it's irritating. Okay, so it's 63 per It's actually updating really fast. This is the boring part of the thing. Other than when I was struggling with downloading the app, I had to delete my Google account and clean the Play Store cache. This is going to be so much easier when I get an iPhone soon. Okay, so it's loading. I don't know what it's doing. Um, okay. Okay, so now I have to enable this button. Accessibility. Wait, what button am I turning on? To, to enable accessibility services. Okay. What does it mean? This doesn't make any sound. I'm confused. Oh, the pebble. Oh, okay. So I gotta turn, press pebble and turn that on. Yes. Uh, Gmail. Sure, whatever. Turn on Gmail. Okay. I'm keeping that private because that's my Gmail account. You just update my Pebble to the latest version for Android. Oh, cool. Let's do a test. Let's do a test email. Neat. Do a test text. Nice. Phone call. Nice. Next. Alright, cool. That's it. Uh, thank you for watching, and this, and this should be fun.